Hello, hello, everybody. It's your boy, Ernest Stewart, a.k.a. Two Windigo, coming at you live and direct. Hey, you know what makes the left angry. I know what makes the left angry. What the left can't stand more than anything else in this world are individuals that do not fit their prescribed narrative and build. All you have to do is stray out of your prescribed line of your dominance hierarchy created by your intersectionality metrics and they will tear you down the first chance they get now normally I'd be coming at this from a really 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 serious place but today however this this one guys this is hot this is hot this is like hot off the presses hot and hot and I mean hot and today we are talking about hot ice as an ice bay taking the internet by storm, blowing everything up. First and foremost, shout out to Hotep Jesus at VibeHI for getting this hashtag started because right now this girl is blowing up. She probably went to sleep and woke up this morning, didn't realize she was gonna be a phenomenon all over the internet. But shout outs to Hotep Jesus for getting the hashtag started. If you guys haven't yet, make sure you go over to Twitter, uh, follow Hotep Jesus, and actually make sure you follow the hashtag Ice Bay. With that said, let's just go ahead and jump into it. We're going to make this one quick and easy today. And I told you this one was going to be spicy. you probably be asking me, yo, Ernest, you said it was hot. How hot is it? Well, my friend, it's hot, hot, hot. Let me tell you, the internet's just going crazy right now, all right? Dudes everywhere, thirsty. All right, this is, this is going to be a thirsty post, all right? This video is just going to be thirst, thirst, and more thirst because that's what Twitter's filled up right, right now, all right? And let me tell you, in that thirst, they want some ice. Every drink you have, you want a little bit of ice in it. But this is the hottest ice you've ever seen in your life. So let's just go ahead and jump into it. So what we have here is Ice Bay, the Latino bro officer. We're grabbing this from Fox News. Um, got a few other uh, articles I'm going to pull up. Just because she's taking the internet by storm, clearly. Um, articles are being written. Look, this is this is just crazy. So you got to hop on this train now. Go ahead, like, favorite, subscribe, follow, and all that good jazz. So let's just get on to it. All right, so female uh, Border Patrol officers gone viral recently, okay? And I already told you before, thanks to Hotep Jesus, by making that hashtag just absolutely blow up. So for starters, she's Hispanic, right? Two, she's an ICE agent, which you know nowadays we got this whole border crisis issue and uh, Trump this, that, and the other wall, the de deportations and all that jazz. And then right, mm, right on the heels of all this, you've got ICE hot. Again, hot, hot, hot. And she just has the internet just, 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 just fiending. Because the thirst is real out here, gentlemen. The thirst is real. We got people out here on Twitter just trying to find ways to get deported. I mean. Anybody know a guy? Because, you know, I'm trying to get deported. Honestly, guys, we know that she is not going to fit the build. All right. She is not going to fit the mold because she and the, the minds of the left is already completely left the reservation. So I can go ahead and tell you right now, this is going to get into some bad territory because they are already attacking her. The girl, from what I understand, was just asleep and woke up to a hashtag campaign that has her name behind it. But the vitriol is real out here. So if you if you want to, go ahead You make sure you sign up, show her some support because she might need it. But I'm expecting to see this face, or as Shapiro would say, the fresh faces go fully fresh and fully face. All over the interwebs and possibly TV. So we're going ahead and just say, you've seen it here first. So this Border Patrol officer is one Kiera Cervantes from Texas. And with just one picture and one hashtag campaign, just completely broken the internet. Did I say hot? But now that we got the basics out of the way, let's go ahead and jump to some of the stories and articles that I've seen up there. So you can get an idea of exactly what's going on. So she did nothing more than just post a picture. Hashtag campaign hit. She broke the internet. Boom. Woke up to being a media storm all right this is going to be amazing because not only does she not fit the bill of what the left would tell you a person her skin complexion is supposed to do believe and think we're going to take it a step further this article from the new york post latina border patrol agent dub ice bay turns out is also a democrat yes you heard me right a democrat reading from the new york post a Latina Border Patrol agent who went viral as Ice Bay after being photographed on duty as registered Democrat from Texas records show. 
Miss Cervantes identified herself Sunday on Twitter as the internet sensation who was snapped during Vice President Pence's recent visit to the Border Detention Center. The female officer who was registered as a Democrat in 2011 later took to social media to say that it was an honor to provide security for the VP. It was an honor and I take a lot of pride in my job, she tweeted on Sunday. And this is where the left is going to have an issue. Voter registration records show that Cervantes, who is from Laredo, didn't vote in the 2016 presidential election. She did, however, exercise her right to vote in 2014. This is where we get into the shit show that is social media. Because they couldn't just leave it alone, right? So what they're going to do is now you're going to see the attacks coming. From the same New York Post. Cervantes fired back Sunday at one social media user who tweeted that her family will disown her and shame on any Hispanic working for ICE or anything of that nature. So already it begins. Simply for working for ICE and being Hispanic. Everything else doesn't matter. She is now a sellout. And I'm going to show you some tweets that echo that same sentiment. It's getting bad out there. And they're just attacking her left and right. Let's go on. Her response was, I think that it's really rude and naive for you to say that, she tweeted in response. You have no idea who my parents are and no idea what goes into my job on a daily basis. Before speaking on something you know nothing about, don't. Regardless, I'm blessed and thankful for the career that I have. Bravo. Bravo, Mr. Monte. See, here's a moment where most people mm, would just be weak. Soft willed, spaghetti spine having, low constitution individuals. And in the midst of this attack, boom, love it. Everything about this, I love it. No apology given, and there better not be one ever on the future. And Cervantes, seems like you're doing a great job. You're blowing up the internet. Hot. But it's, it's, it is, it's looking good. She clearly has a backbone if through this, that is her response. So once again, kudos to you, Ms. Cervantes. Now with that said, I'm also worried that her DMs are going to start looking kind of like... Okay, but joking aside, let's go ahead and look at some of these tweets that's uh, running down this hashtag campaign. I'm telling you, guys, off the bat, some of them might be bad. So if you got little kids, I am going to read some of these off. You got little kids, this is the part where I tell you right now that this video is going to probably get demonetized just for me reading what I'm seeing in these, these hashtag results. All right, so be forewarned, we're going to go through a few of them just so you can see what the vitriol is looking like. So a few tweets off the bat. Y'all bitches never cease to amaze me with how fucking stupid y'all are sometimes. Y'all niggas are clowns. I thought Ice Bay was a pretty girl who licked on ice or whatever, like that ice cream girl. You knee. I can't say the rest because I don't want this video to get banned. Are salivating over an Ice Bay. Coons the lot of you. I hate to say it, but Ice Bay is hilarious and sad at the same time. And take a look at some of the memes that are being made about her. Feeling cute today might separate some kids later. We got some real good SJW stuff in the comment section. Cishet men are effing disgusting. Also, anyone who works for ICE is disgusting. F this Ice Bay BS. Ugh. It's a glorious time to be on Twitter, guys. It's a glorious time to be on Twitter. You want to have some fun? Check out the Ice Bay hashtag. So I wanted to bring this to you guys' attention, so if you ever get a chance to go over to Twitter, jump in on the hashtag campaign, show some support, show some love, because once again, the left saw something that does not fit their build. You got a beautiful Latina woman working for ICE who is currently registered as a Democrat, but clearly has enough fortitude to have some wherewithal and courage to do her job and stand up for the position that she is in. But look, I know this was a thirsty one. I know. I know. And the internet's going to feel that way too. And that's fine by me. Because no shame in my game. But however guys, if you like this video, make sure you like, favorite, and subscribe. And as usual, it's your boy, Ernest Stewart, a.k.a. True Wendigo. And I am Political Blackout. Y'all have a good one. Deuces. P.S. Somebody get this video over to ICE. Let, look, let's just be honest. You guys need a new fresh face, all right? You need a fresh face. It's so fresh, so face. Right now, hot ice is where it's at. So I'm just going to let you know right now. If you guys need a fresh face 
Somebody, share this with ICE. Let them get it. Let them know right now. You need a face to the organization? You already found one. She might have been a patrol officer before. New job found, baby. Throw up these people. So fresh. So face. And while I'm at it, I'm going to go check with my boy Pedro and see how to get deported. Hey, Pedro! You still got the papers?